Want to get you a check of the desert Doppler rain? That's the big weather story for today. It's not all that impactful considering rain totals and rain intensity is still fairly light, but we're picking up light rain just south of Boulder City. It looks like Lake Mead drying out. A couple sprinkles lingering through Henderson, Green Valley into Anthem, but the concentration of this rain at this point is south of the valley along the 15. Keep that in mind if you're heading to Southern California or Prim, uh, but for most of us, we're pretty dry. Even the spring mountains drying out, most of this precipitation has shifted off the mountains so some light rain falling for Pahrump. And as we zoom out across uh, Clark County, it looks like things in general are calming down. Our next focus will be here in Southern Clark County. See, uh, this is closing in on searchlight. This rain intensity picking up a little bit. So if you're in searchlight, uh, some light to moderate rain could be falling in the next hour or so. It's something that we'll be tracking through the five o'clock hour. Uh, other than that, just the cloud cover and the cool temperatures with these cloudy skies right now. Our temps are quite a bit cooler than this time yesterday, capped right around 60 degrees. Some spots upper 50s like Centennial Hills and Summerlin, uh, some spots up to about 62 like in Nellis. Through the remainder of your Tuesday night, expect that mostly cloudy sky to continue and we're keeping an isolated rain chance in play. But with that cloud cover, it takes us a little longer to cool off. The cloud cover tends to lock in a little warm through the overnight hours, so we're still in the low 50s as of about 10 p.m. We're funneling in that Pacific moisture, so that's what's keeping the rain chance in play through late tonight, but eventually this will clear. If you're out and about before about midnight, we'll keep that 20% rain chance in the forecast. After midnight, this seems to clear out, and by the time we wake up tomorrow morning, we're back to a mostly sunny sky, so we're milder on Wednesday. The sky is more clear and our temperatures will be allowed to rebound. Our lows start in the upper 40s tomorrow morning in the Las Vegas Valley and highs back to the mid 60s, and that's for most of the region. So it'll end up being a beautiful day tomorrow with a light breeze, plenty of sunshine and a temperature right near 65 at McCarran. On the west side, low 60s on the uh, east side, mid to upper 60s. So that's five to eight degrees above the seasonal average but we're not done with the storms just yet. Mount Charleston showing what we're watching heading toward Thursday. Our next more significant snowstorm in this one will cause issues if you have any travel plans to higher elevations. Winter weather advisory starting 4 a.m. for elevations greater than 6,000 feet. If you're between 6 and 8,000 feet up to 7 inches of snow, peaks picking up up to a foot with gusts of 40 miles per hour. I want to show you that as it sweeps through on future casts. So this uh, will show increasing cloud cover Early Thursday morning by the morning commute, the rain and snow chance starts and we'll see widespread rain chances through Thursday late afternoon, early evening. Behind that, much colder temperatures, highs fall to the low 50s with lows in 30s heading into the weekend.